Hi everyone, welcome back to the homestead. If you're new here, welcome. Glad you came and joined us. Today we are a week in to our new family cow who is actually our foster cow. And if you um, have not seen the video on that, I will link it in the description below. Toby. But this is Toby, our foster cow, and I'm just giving a little update on how things are going. So right away the first night that we got her, we noticed her teats were a little cracked and one had a cut on it. We weren't planning on separating Toby and her calf that first night, but we did anyway, just so I could get treatment started. I didn't want this to progress any farther. Most likely it's from him and from him being a little overzealous nursing. Sometimes they have a little bit of a sharp teeth and that causes the cracks and just drying out um, just from being out in the elements. So every night I've been putting vitamin E on her teeth and Corona cream and then we separate at night so then that allows the, the treatment to really soak in and definitely have noticed them improving a lot. And as far as milk production, we are up to about three quarters of a gallon. That is a huge improvement. Even though it's not a ton, it's big from last week. The first day I got a whole cup of milk. <laughs> she was not wanting me to take anything. She wouldn't let down until I let him out of the stall. And then I had the problem of having to fight him for the teats because he wanted them and I wanted them. So it was probably pretty comical to watch. But like I said, we've improved a lot. Now she has no problem letting down. She knows that after I'm done milking, I'm going to give the calf back. And then she has them all day long and he gets to nurse all day long. Another thing that's affecting what how much milk we're getting is my own strength and I kind of forgot how hard it is to hand milk and she was a little bit difficult to hand milk at first. Her flow was really not very great but we've improved and my strength is gaining so I'm getting a little bit better, a little bit faster and able to get more before I'm like completely drained and have no strength left. <laughs> As long as I keep hay in front of her, Toby stands great for me, which I love and appreciate very much. She likes to fling her hay around sometimes, so occasionally I have to get up and put hay back in front of her, but for the most part, she does great. And we are finally getting a really awesome cream line, and I cannot wait to make butter and cheese and all the good yummy things. That's my update on our foster cow, Toby. Our one week in, we have gone from a cup a day to three quarters of a gallon a day. So this is fabulous. I cannot wait to increase this a little bit more. Hopefully we drink about a half a gallon a day. So don't have a ton of extra, but I know that we still will be able to make a lot of fun things. And so stay tuned for those videos. And thank you again for joining me on the homestead. Bye.